I'm Harney Marco and I'm a biology teacher at Cita Verde College back in the Netherlands in Heerlen. That's what I do. I think they contacted me because I'm a well-known phase of citizen scientist. Um, I discovered something in space through this website galaxyzoo.org. So I think that's why. Galaxy Zoo is an online astronomy project for citizen scientists, so basically for everybody. And uh, the scientists had initially uh, a million, a data set of a million pictures, and they wanted to know, in short, about shapes of the galaxies. So uh, they asked the public to uh, help them classify those. So you get beautiful pictures on your screen, and you just press a button. That's it, really. And I found out through Brian May, Queen's guitarist, and he posted it on his website. And I thought, this sounds cool, let's sign up. And after a week, I got something on one of those pictures, and I asked the scientists, what is this? Because it didn't look like anything um, they described you could see. So, and it did turn out to be something totally new. Um, it's called Honey's Vorwerp. That's a very Dutch and boring word for objects. I didn't make up the name, but I like the fact that everybody in England is saying Vorwerp. Um, and it's, well, we do know a few, few facts about it. It's a huge gas cloud, galaxy sized. Um, it's, it's green. It looks like a dancing frog in the sky, really. And it's very bright and very hot. Um, we didn't see any stars in it. Um, so there are lots of investigations going on, uh, even with the Hubble Space Telescope. And we expect those to come out very soon. So stay tuned. <laughs> Yes, definitely, and not just because you uh, because you can discover something. Because I never knew I could. I didn't sign up to discover something. Um, Brian May said, you know, you can help scientists, and uh, it's not a difficult job, and it's an, it's a nice job because you're looking at beautiful pictures. Um, so that's why I signed up. And there are actually, I think, there are eight papers at the moment that they've written uh, about all the outcome. So it's, it's great that even if you're not a scientist, you can actually participate and that's the fun part.